An update review of intradialytic hypotension, concept, risk factors, clinical implications and management. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Intradialytic hypotension, IDH, is a frequent and serious complication of chronic hemodialysis, linked to adverse long-term outcomes including increased cardiovascular and all-cause mortality. Definitions of IDH differ. In general, is a decrease in either systolic blood pressure more than 20 mm of mercury or mean arterial pressure more than 10 mm of mercury leading to symptoms. See the established definitions. IDH is the end result of the interaction between ultrafiltration rate, UFR, cardiac output and arteriolar tone. The excessive ultrafiltration may decrease cardiac output, especially when compensatory mechanisms, heart rate, myocardial contractility, vascular tone and splanchnic flow shifts, fail to be optimally recruited. The UFR is a key predisposing factor to IDH, especially when it exceeds the plasma refill rate. Decreased cardiac output has a key role in the IDH, changes in preload and afterload, a decrease in contractility and a failure to maintain arteriolar tone due autonomic dysfunction play a major role in IDH. Risk factors for the development of IDH are diabetes, cardiovascular disease, ischemic heart disease, arrhythmias and vascular calcification, autonomic dysfunction, poor nutritional status, hypoalbuminemia, female sex, age more than 65 years, pre-dialysis SBP less than 100 mm of mercury, high body mass index and severe anemia. IDH was associated with myocardial infarction, hospitalization for volume overload and cardiovascular, all-cause mortality, repeated cerebral ischemia and dementia, loss of residual renal function, vascular access thrombosis, mesenteric ischemia and even liver ischemia. Prevention and treatment to decrease the incidence or severity of IDH include optimization of the dialysis prescription, cool dialysate 35 to 36 degrees Celsius, UFR less than 10 to 13 milliliters hour kilogram by increasing time or frequency, avoid lower facility levels of dialysate calcium less than 2.5 MEQL, avoid routine sodium profiling with superphysiological dialysate sodium concentrations, High flux hemofiltration compared with diffusive techniques like low flux HD. Interventions during the dialysis session, Trendelenburg position and stop ultrafiltration, mitodrine, fluid administration, avoid food intake during or just before dialysis, intradialytic exercise and intermittent pneumatic compression of the lower limbs. Interventions in the interdialysis period, lower interdialytic weight gain with low sodium intake and loop diuretics and blood pressure lowering drugs, and switching the modality to PD. See the summary of the interdialytic hypotension treatment. Kidney today. Thanks for watching.